Hey everyone, today I'm gonna to be showing you how to install the Tusk Defender UTV cargo box on your Polaris Razor XP1000. This is a great way to bring some extra items with you out on the trail. And the install process is really simple. Let's go ahead and get into it. At the back of the machine, we're gonna use our T40 Torx bit. We need seven bolts out of the back panel. We're gonna lower this down and out of the way. Just be careful not to damage any wires when you do that. Now I'm gonna take one of the M8 by 55 millimeter bolts, go through a cup washer. You've got the rubber sleeve you're going through, and then we've got that T-nut on top. You wanna to leave this a little loose until it's set in place. So we're just coming through the bottom. You have these two mounting locations right here. Come up through the bottom, and then once everything is tightened down, you want the T-nut to be flush with the back of the bed right here. So we're just gonna take our 13 millimeter socket and tighten that down. And we'll do those same steps for the other side right here. After that, we can reinstall the back panel and just verify that all of the nut clips are still in place. The next step is to prep your cargo box. So if you look on the bottom side towards the back, you can see we already have two holes drilled out here, but a brand new box should have a dimple in each location. And you're just gonna use your half inch drill bit to drill through those spots. And then once you do, you can take a razor blade and clean those areas up. After that, you wanna set the cargo box into the bed and you're gonna line up those two holes that you just drilled with the two bolts we installed. Now I'm gonna open this cargo box up. You're gonna to wanna to take the plane washers and the hand knobs. We're gonna install those onto those two bolts that are coming up through this cargo box. And then before I tighten the knobs all the way, I'm gonna adjust the box. You do have a little bit of movement, both front and back and side to side. So once you have it in the best spot, you can go ahead and tighten those down. For the front brackets, you need to drill two holes in the cargo box, you can see we've already done that. But to get to this point, what you need to do, you've got a mounting location right here in your bed. You're gonna line up the slot in the mounting bracket with that. Just make sure it's centered up side to side. And then you can take a punch or a pick, go through this top mounting location in that front bracket, mark where you need to drill, and then you can use your 3 8 or half inch drill bit to drill that out. A half inch is just gonna give you a little more room to work with and adjustability. Now we can take the eye bolt, install a washer onto it, go through the slot in the bracket, and we have the rubber sleeve. Go into the mounting location, be careful not to drop that rubber sleeve. And then from the bottom, you're gonna install the cup washer and that serrated flange nut. And I'm just gonna leave this a little loose for right now. And I'm gonna go in from the inside. We're gonna take the hand knob, put a washer on it, and thread it into this upper mounting location. Then once you have that started, go ahead and tighten the knob down as well as the nut on the bottom. And when you tighten down that nut, it can be helpful to use a wrench to hold that eyelet in place. And then you just need to repeat those steps for the other side. That's it for installing the Tusk Defender UTV cargo box on your Polaris Razor XP1000. If you have any questions, leave those down in the comments. And if you need to pick one of these up, you can find them on our website or just click the link in the description below. We offer free shipping on orders over $75. And if you want to see more helpful content like this, subscribe to our channel. I'm Charles with Rocky Mountain ATVMC. Thanks for watching.